hello guys hope you are doing well so here i am again with a new video tutorial that is around moodle so in this tutorial we will see how you can configure your outgoing mail in moodle so this video i am creating on the request received from one of my viewer on youtube and he was saying that i am using the correct credential of my gmail but still it is not working in my case okay so my friend this will not be working with your normal credential you will have to use uh, the app password along with your username okay and app password yes of course it is different from a, a normal password so when you try to log in with your normal gmail account from the google.com you will have to use your normal password along with your email id but here in this case of modal outgoing mail configuration that will not be working why because the, this configuration support app password only now what is app password yes coming to that so after logging to your email gmail you can create a app password with this step okay so you see here the lindy docs and the description so i will directly give you uh, this link okay you will find this in the description of this video so the moment you log in to your account suppose you are already logged in with your gmail credential now you just have to type this okay my account dot google dot com got it so after coming to this you will find this setting options so click here on it then you see here the two steps verification click on it now it will be asking for your credential once to verify whether or you are the same user yes someone is trying with the dipin so i just put it my correct credential here okay now so at the end of this page you see here the app password okay so you'll have to create click on this arrow icon from here you can create your app password. suppose i am using this i am just typing my name just moodle okay so you can type suppose you are working with a multiple moodle clients then you'll have to type moodle one two three okay so this way you can manage and yes this is my app password okay i just use you will have to remove the spaces okay this and this will be go inside the setting of that in place of password okay so let's get started uh, in a moodle part now so for this configuration changes will you must have the site administration role so i'm already logging in my local instance then you see the servers then you will have to come to this outgoing mail configuration click on it for the gmail you will have to use this okay so currently you see i am just using my normal credential this is my email id and this one is my password okay now let me try testing this if i try sending mail to myself it will not be working with my normal credential okay let's see what it say your site could not communicate with your mail server please use your please check your outgoing mail control so this way you will see the issue got it so how, how you can fix this you will have to use so everything go the same way smtp remains the same in the smtp security you will have to pick the ssl here the smtp auth type you will have to type login uh, smtp user your gmail will go here and under your smtp password your this app password will go okay so this you will have to paste and make sure you are pasting the correct uh, app password got it now i am going to save this click on save changes 
now again here on this page i am going to dry my test page from where you will find this again let me come to the, this will on the same page of the setting you see here the test outgoing mail click on it i am going to send mail to myself success let's see what it say yes the site has successfully sent a test message to your mail server from this email id to this email id got it let me check yes i just received my email you see here the zero minute ago test message type okay this is test confirm that you have successfully configured on your site outgoing mail so this is how you you can configure your outgoing mail but still in case you are facing any issue during the uh, your setup or your model instance please let me know i will help you out from that too okay so hope this will help you to configure uh, at your end and still you are watching and you have not subscribed my channel please uh, i would suggest you subscribe for my all the future video thank you thank you for watching and have a great day